All right, obviously today I am way outside the box for me. I've driven down to Plaquemines Parish. I'm on the west bank of the Mississippi River, and my goal today is to catch a catfish. When this river gets low and slow, these blue cats are often really easy to catch, and I'm hoping that's the case today. Unfortunately, I got a really strong northeast wind blowing right in my face, but I've got some fish heads from a previous trip. I'm gonna use this bait. I'm gonna maybe even try and chump some up. We'll see if we can catch something. This ought to be interesting. All right, I brought a couple of different rods for this experiment, is what this really is. I don't know how this is gonna work, but these are some fish heads from a trip I made with Joe Levine on the Tangipahoa River. Looks pretty nice, huh? If I was a catfish, I'd eat that, wouldn't you? But I'm rigged up here with some 65 pound soft steel with a 1 16th ounce death grip. This is quite a uh, quite a head here. So I'll hook him in the mouth. It's gonna take quite a catfish to eat this. I definitely want enough hook exposed to be able to hook the cat. How does that look? All right, let's give it a whirl. I've got this on a big pin snapper rod that I've actually never used in my entire life. And of course, being the Mississippi River, the current is, sw is swift. And that bursa mask can barely hold up that head. That head is heavy. I did bring some tackle, so I may have to go with something that'll hold on this bottom. Cork may not be the way to go. I thought it would be, but I wasn't really expecting this much wind. Now, the good thing with fishing right here is there's lots of rocks, so there's lots of places to put this rod to where I don't have to man it full time. Just let it sit and fish for me. Not typically my style of fishing, but I did bring some other rods to maybe try and catch a bass or a redfish along here. The water's not the best. That wind's blowing straight into these rocks, but who knows, we might get lucky. All right, I got a good place for that rod. It's not going anywhere. I've got another one with an Akuma Komodo. Same setup with the Versamax hybrid. We put the other half of this fish on here. Position this one down current a little bit. Get away from this one. Hope I don't break my neck. And of course, they blow straight into the rocks, but I don't think that's a problem. I think those fish are going to kind of cling to these rocks. It's only a problem if you get snagged. Of course, here comes a big ship. Wake is imminent. All right, those two rods are fishing. So now I'm gonna see what I can catch with this. H&H &H Gold Spinner. Uh-oh, fish on, fish on, fish on. I don't know if he's still on. Oh, I think he got off. He must have broke me. I can't tell if he's still on or not. I think he is. Yes, he is. Look at that big cat. Big cat. Oh, look at these wakes. Look at this wake. Oh my God. Oh God. I knew that wake would be big. I don't know it'd be that big. And hey, look at this cat. Look at this catfish. <laughs> I've been fishing five minutes. Come on, dude, get over this. Look at this. Look at this beast with a ship passing. That was a gigantic ship wake. I was not expecting it to be that big. Look at this fish. He is totally lassoed. That's a big catfish. I don't know how I'm gonna get him. I'm gonna walk into this water. I'm already soaked from that ship wake. Look at this. Hey, big boy. 
Oh, how are we gonna get you? How are we gonna get you, big fella? Oh. Oh no. Oh no, don't get away. Not now. Let me get your mouth. Come on, dude, let me get your mouth. I can't reach. All right. Got him. Oh. <laughs> All right, these rocks are super slippery now after that big wig. This is a monster. I think the. Oh, oh he's not hooked anymore. Uh oh, he broke off. I gotta get him. He broke that line. All right, get the rod later. All right, I've been fishing five minutes and look what I got. Big beast, big beautiful cat. He busted up my knuckles when he tried to get away. Oh, he's biting my hand. Oh. <laughs> what a pig. Oh, ow. Now he ripped up this hand. Can't say I blame you, dude. I get it. Should've worn some gloves. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go. Oh, He's gonna get away. He is just ripping my hands to shreds. Look at this guy. He is just destroying my hands. Look at this. I cannot let this fish get away. But man, my hands are just torn up. Wish I'd worn some gloves. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, don't get away. Don't get away, dude. No. All right. All right, let's see if we can get you to the truck. Oh, let go of my rod. Oh. 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 I can't tell you what this dude is doing to my hands. <laughs> Absolutely worth it though, look at this pig. I gotta go see if I can collect all my rods. Five minutes, five minutes. That's how long it, it took to catch him. Ship week passing and everything, we still got him. I wish I had something to grip this thing with. Make life a lot easier. I'm worn out. All right, dude, come on. How about you be nice? How about you play nice? You play nice and I'll, well, I'll fillet you. But you don't know that yet, you don't really care. I know, I know. Yeah, you're gonna do it again, aren't you? All right, I think I'm just gonna leave him right here for now. I'm gonna try and catch another one. You know, cause I'm a glutton for punishment. I gotta get another jig head though. Cause he wrecked that one. All right. Let me clean up this mess. See if we can get another one. That was freaking awesome. <laughs> oh boy, we have a mess. Ah, it's all right. It's all right. We got the fish. We got the fish. Yeah, he broke off a lot of that line. Gotta start from scratch. All right, I was a little bit nervous about this. I thought our bait washed out into the river when that ship passed, but it's just pushed up under this rock. We still got it. All right, that worked out well. Let's uh, let's hook him in the same spot. No more ships. You know, it's not like ships use this river or anything. All right, there we go. Come on, big nasty cat. Come on, big nasty cat. Where are we gonna put this? There we go, here's our spot. All right, you know, I've been fortunate to catch a good number of fish over the course of my career, but not many more fun than that one. That was an absolute blast. Got the battle scars to prove it, but that fish is a beast. So awesome. When this river gets low this time of year, Everything bites, it just goes crazy. You don't need a boat, you get out here and catch some fish, get dinner for a week. All right, I guess I need to go check on that other rod. It really hasn't gotten anything to speak of. I might move it this way, 
so it's a little more manageable. I tell you, these rocks, I don't know how long it had been since a big ship like that passed, but when I first got out here, these rocks were really, really dry, but now they're super wet and super slippery. Just gotta take my time, not twist an ankle or worse. This one's gonna be fun to get. Uh oh, here comes another ship. Look at that. <laughs> I think I'm gonna take this tail section off and put on a head. Just not as much, you know, smell and guts and stuff in this tail section. Use that as chum. Gotta hurry before that ship gets here. Guess I'll chum with this tail too. Here's a big head, we'll go with him. Hook you in the mouth as well, boy. There we go. Go catch me a catfish. Catch me a broken neck. All right, let's find a good hole to put it in. All right, that looks like a good one. You look in the front of that ship, pretty decent wake. I don't think it's as big as the last one, but we need to be prepared in case it is. Time to get our prize up into the truck. I think he's a little more subdued now, or at least I hope. My hands are torn to shreds. Ow, he's biting my finger. Let go, dude. Ow. There we go. I don't want to lose you. Yeah, he's in the truck. All right, this ship wake is not nearly as bad. All right, well, that's working. Let's see if we can get a, a bass or something like that, or a red, or if I can catch my breath. Got one of the rocks. Ah, oh, I got more tackle in the truck, but I'm scared to leave these rods. All right, we got another bait. Now one of my quartz is gone. What's the deal? What is the deal? Is that a fish, or is it stuck under a rock? It's not pulling line yet. If it is a fish, I'm betting it's stuck under a rock. A tugboat just passed. May have pushed the bait up under a rock. Let me tie this on. Give the fish a minute to run. If it is a fish, but yeah, that cork is gone. Where are you, cork? I think that fish would have run by now. All right, let's see what's going on. Oh yeah, oh, it came free, there we go. Still got our bait, let's make another cast. Now something I forgot about with this Komodo reel, it's actually got a clicker. I never fished this way, so I really kind of forgot about it, but it'll make noise and let you know you got a bite. So let's uh, turn that on and get back to fishing. Hopefully we get a bite soon. I got another fish. I got another fish. Uh oh, hopefully the line doesn't break. It's going. Take your time, Todd. Don't break your neck. Uh oh. Oh. Uh oh. Oh, stay there, Ryan. All right, I see you. All right, another fish. Big, big cat. Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. Big cat. Woo! <laughs> I 
reel's coming loose. I think this is a 3,000 reel. Really not designed for what we're doing. Now we just gotta hope that one doesn't hook up. Man, the last one, the ship wig, helped me land the fish. No such luck on this one. There you go. There you go. <laughs> what a blast. What an absolute blast. Big game fishing while standing on the bank. Now he went on the other side of that other line. This, we're gonna have a disaster. Hopefully it runs back to the right. Just let that current push you, dude. Just let that current push you. Let's try and pull him this way. Maybe he'll pull against this. Nope. <laughs> He's running into that current. All right, there's the cork. There's that Versamax. Oh, look at that big blue cat. Beautiful cat. I see you, dude. Oh, look at my, my fish head is up the line. All right, it did its job. Look at this guy. <laughs> Come on, dude. I'm d oh, whoa, something slipped. Something slipped. I thought I lost him. All right, he's on the other side of the cork. Let's see if we can get him. What probably slipped is that line was around his tail, I'm betting. He's not done, I'll tell you that. He might be bigger than the last. This is a big fish. Oh goodness, he is a giant. How are we gonna get you up on these rocks, dude? How are we gonna get you on these rocks? How are we gonna get you up here? Don't break my 65 pound line, please, like your buddy did. All right, we go. Come on, head this way. Come on, head this way. Come on, dude. I'm not grabbing your mouth like I did your buddy. I just don't have it in me. My hands are too torn up. I'm also not grabbing that line because I'm not an idiot. Oh, he's barely hooked. Look at that. Look at that. I didn't bring a net. A net would have been awesome. All right, dude. I'm not putting my rod down. I don't trust you. Definitely not grabbing the line. All right, if you do this, I highly recommend you bring a gaff or a net. Don't be stupid like me. I'm gonna have to grab your mouth, huh? How about your tail? Nope, you don't like that, do you? It's over, dude. Look, come on. Come on, seriously. Yeah, just come this way. Yeah, I know. I know. You're close to getting your freedom, I'll tell you that. I think he's bigger, yeah, I think he's bigger than the last. He is a giant. Yeah, I see you, dude. Look, don't pull that, don't pull that jig head out, all right? Yeah, I know, you don't like me. <laughs> he is just so barely hooked. He is so barely hooked, he's about to get off. I almost hate to horse him because he is gonna pull this jig head free. I'm gonna stick, ow, stick my hand in your mouth again. I want to add some gloves. All right, dude. All right, dude. Sandpaper. Yeah, I'd much rather grab your gill. Yeah, I know. You don't like that. I don't like it either. Oh, goodness, there's a giant. There's a giant. Oh, let's get this rod up. <laughs> Look at this guy. This is a freaking giant. Look at this fish. Look at this fish. Oh my goodness. <sighs> yeah, I don't want you to rest, dude. I don't want you to rest, sorry. Uh, uh. No, 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 don't start flopping. All right. Note to self, bring a net or a gaff, preferably a gaff. This is a giant. This is a gorilla. 
how am I gonna get this fish out of here on these rocks? Come on, dude. Let's just take a little walk. You and me. You and me. Don't hit my camera. Don't hit my camera, dude. Woo! <laughs> this is flat out awesome. Look at this fish. Just a monster. You pair him to this to this rod. Just a just a beast. I'm plum tuckered. All right, look at this jig head. You see what I was talking about? It's just barely in the corner of his mouth. Actually, it's in there better than I expected it to be. That's why he didn't get off. There, it's, it's out now. If he starts flopping, he's gonna regain his freedom. We're gonna see if we can get him in the truck. <sighs> All right, I'm gonna reel this one in. I'm pretty guy doesn't have a fish on it. It does not. That's good. Cause I'm done. Is there anything good right there? I got a big cat. Oh, yeah. yeah. Any saltwater fish? Uh-uh. Catfish. Oh. He's a beast. <laughs> He's a beast. Look at this fish. That is a beautiful catfish. Yeah, no doubt. Yeah, good. yeah that's a good catch, brother. <laughs> What is that, like a flat? What kind of cat? cat no, it's a blue cat. It's a blue, blue cat. cat. Look how big that sucker is. That's good eating, man. Yeah, it's very good eating. Yeah, very oh, underrated. <laughs> He's a beast. <laughs> trying to get him to the... nice fish I just caught. Trying to get him to the truck. <laughs> Damn! <laughs> oh my god. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Uh, yeah, no doubt he did. Uh, uh, he weighs probably, I'm guessing, north of 40. It's a big fish, big big oh. head. I don't think I've ever seen a fish that big. Uh, all right, well, nice meeting y'all. Take care. I'm gonna pick up my stuff. All right, I'm calling it a day. I just do not have another fight in me. <laughs> Super successful. I've not been out here very long at all. Awesome, awesome action. Just fantastic. Oh, goodness, this fish is super heavy. Oh. 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 All right, dude, come on. Oh. Oh. All right. All right. Oh. <laughs> He's definitely bigger than the first. No doubt. All right, now I gotta grab my rods. Well, I'm absolutely exhausted. But the good kind of exhausted, I'll take it. All right, I'm gonna get these fish cleaned up and feed all my friends. Just an absolutely incredible experience. Can't recommend this highly enough. Get here while this river's low and come catch some of these catfish. They're all up and down this river, absolutely everywhere. I'm here down in the Beerus area of Plaquemines Parish. You can catch them throughout Plaquemines Parish, believe me. If you enjoyed the video, please share it with a friend who you think would like to do this. And also give it a thumbs up. If you haven't done so yet, please subscribe to the Marshman Masson channel. And don't forget to ring the notification bell so you're notified whenever we post a new video. Until next time, if we don't see you in the marsh or right here at the river, we'll see you right here on Marshman Masson. <laughs>